depreciations, deductions, you know, they're, that can get you in trouble, but it can also be something that really um, changes everything you do. Those cost segregators, though, that is really helpful if you have uh, commercial properties. That's exactly right. And on our Sunrisers group, I had this guy, Matt Kemp is his name, and that's his company down there, the um, uh, link that you see. If you click on that link, they can, uh, actually, they sell you this cost segregator. I think it's $450 per property for you to see whether or not your rental property is worth doing the cost segregation. If, if your property is worth 600,000 or more, it's kind of a no-brainer. But on individual rental properties, especially if you're doing Airbnb, you know, the short-term furnished rentals, it's, it, there, you have more things that you can deduct. The age of the house, you know, there's just different things that you can deduct and it's worth checking it out to see if you can go ahead and do the cost segregation. People say, well, what is cost segregation? Go ahead. Uh, no, that's what I was going to say. I know you're say. chomping at the uh, no, I'm just saying, let's explain what cost segregation yeah, is. So as, you know, uh, as, a, as a landlord, as a property owner, you are able to deduct certain costs in a house and certain things are going to wear out quicker than others. A roof will only last, what, 15, 20 years. Well, Although they H give you a 30 year warranty. Yeah. On <laughs> uh, HVAC uh, only lasts 10 and 11 years nowadays. Mm -hmm. It used to be we had a washer that would last 25 yeah. years, but that's not the case anymore. But you so could appliances, sell new washers. <laughs> appliances are at like seven years, I think. Um, flooring, carpet, hardwood, tile, it all has its different lifespan. Right. And so when you're segregating that cost, you are actually taking all of those deductions in a bonus kind of upfront. Yeah, so the way the tax laws are set up right now, and that's right now, they're subject to change. Mm -hmm. uh, you're able to deduct quicker because typically when you do depreciation, it's over a longer 27 period of time. years, I think it is. Right. I know it's at least 20. Yeah. But you're able to take uh, those items that wear out quicker, you're able to uh, take those items and depreciate them early up, up front, front right. within the first year or two. Um, that, so that makes a big difference. You're, yes. you're getting a lot, lot more money quicker uh, instead of having to wait for it. Exactly, so give it a shot.